Isaiah Briscoe. His first three-pointer of the night. That is his seventh of the season. 10-6. Wolves in front. Nemhart coming down the left side. Underhand scoop. Lays it up and in as he soared to the end that he never did make, didn't, never did touch the basketball. Windler out front. On the right wing now to Nemhart. Brings it out front between the circles. Grabbed by Lewis. Gets past him. Right side of the backboard. On the rim and in. Five minutes to play first quarter. Bowen on the left wing, guarded by Trey Scott, has it knocked away, stolen by Dylan Windler. Out in front of the pack is R.J. Nemhart, drives again, scores with the right hand, crosses over Nemhart, left block, skips it, good ball movement, right corner, Edwards the open three, rim no good, tapped up in the air, controlled by Josh Hustis. One hands it out to Nemhart, chest pass to James, right down the middle of the lane, floats and scores again. He's got nine, 45-41 charge, Couple of ticks over five minutes to play in the half. Guy coming down the left side, off the left side of the backboard. Monday, December the 27th, when the Charge take on the main Celtics. That'll be at six o'clock. Off the timeout, Charge have it, leading 47-45. Coming up on the four minute mark of the first half. Left wing, Nemart steps into the jump shot, and they're gonna count it as a three one to play in the half. 52-47, Charge in front. R.J. Nemart hooks it to Trey Scott for the wide open straightaway. Three, rattled it in. Trey Scott. And right there, 14 points for Vince Edwards. 60-52 charge. 35 seconds of play in the half. Nemhart into the lane, turns one hand. Floating jump shot. R.J. have it. Left free throw line extended. Pangos will inbound. Straight away out front to Scott. Hands it back to Windler. R.J. Nemhart straight away. Six on the clock. Working on Edwards, shoots the right top three ball. Splashes that one home. I reported today, but did not see him warm up, and he has yet to play this evening. Doesn't look like he will tonight. RJ Nemart has it for Cleveland. Left corner to Trey Scott. Thought about the three, shoots the three, and nails the three. Brian Bowen out front to Edwards, steps into a left top three, and somebody got a piece of that. Norvell Pell closed for the block. Scott, right wing, another three, another make, Trey Scott, back to back three. Briscoe, Briscoe, cut off by Pango, shoots the 15 foot jumper, goes 16 feet, but it's caught on the air ball by Trey Scott to RJ Nemhard. Charge looking for their biggest lead of the ball game. Underneath left side layup by our two by a rim. Boy, I don't know what's going on at the free throw line, but Matt Lewis tries to answer with the three at the other end, can't do it. Kevin Pango's the two hand rebound for the charge. Goes to Nemhart, coming down the left side, gets past Miller. Underhand scoop, spins it around the rim, and it drops. Is it the Silva? Hands back to Lewis, a straightaway three-pointer. This one's off the rim, no good, and controlled by R.J. Nemhart. Chest pass, front court to James, right back to Nemhart. Gives it to Guy for the open straightaway. Three! Bangs it home. Nemhart. The navy blue 22 on the back of his home wine uniform. Slight knee bend, flips it up, flips it in. Two and a half to play, charge 121-112. Both teams over the limit. We'll be shooting free throws for the final 220. Nemhard out front between the circles. Left hand to the wing, keeps his dribble, comes into the lane, goes to Trey Scott on the right wing. Goes right corner to Nemhart, the three ball. He got it! RJ Nem and they are going to get the win improved to six and four, four and one here at the Wolstein Center. They've won four straight games. For the Wolves, they'll drop to four and four. They've lost three in a row, and they are now one and three away from home. Nemart turns left of the lane, shoots and scores.